Activision. What the actual fuck? So all these leaks, if you guys have been paying attention at all, um, all these leaks have come out about MW2 Remastered. And, you know, everyone was so fucking hyped because World War II is, I'm not going to lie, it was a big flop, you know. It, it got a lot of sales just off of the World War II hype alone. And now we heard about Black Ops 4, obviously, is coming out. And then we got MW2 Remastered. Everyone was all excited and shit. They were like, oh, fuck yeah, MW2. And then they have the balls to come out and say, there's no multiplayer. Bitch, who the fuck plays Call of Duty for the campaign like come on the campaign I can last longer than bed than the fucking campaign is man like could you imagine how much m and they're selling it for $25 who the fuck's gonna buy it for $25 that's like buying a, a Lamborghini for its gas mileage like who the fuck would buy Call of Duty for the campaign man especially for 25 bucks so come on, and could you imagine how much money Activision can make off of multiplayer alone? I mean, I mean, like the gameplay you're watching right now with the Boss 14, like this was a DLC gun. This gun's not even the in the original COD 4. Like you know they were gonna add all these guns and all kinds of shit, right? Like it, there's no doubt, you know they make so much money, all like these greedy bastards off these supply drops. So they're definitely gonna put it in there and add all these guns and camos and shit. But the it's just, I don't understand, man. Like, I don't even care that there was going to be supply drops in, like, MW2. I still would have played the fuck out of it because that was a great game. If you guys aren't old enough to have, like, enjoyed MW2 in its prime, look at this motherfucker. You, like, who, pl that's how this game is played right now. MWR, Modern Warfare Remastered. Kids, I went back here and just played a couple games, and kids actually play like that. Sitting upstairs, zoomed in like Chris Kyle with a fucking Dragunov and overkill. Not even like stopping power, overkill. Or juggernaut. It's like, come on, man. So now I can't go out there because I know he's camping up there like a little bitch. But um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, like MW2, if you guys didn't get to play it, it was a lot of fun, you know. It was when they first added in like the tactical nuke that ended the game. It was the first like game ending score streak or 25 kill streak, whatever you want to call it, in Call of Duty. Um... It, to be honest, it was pretty easy to get. It was probably too easy because look at this shit. Like at this point in the game, I hopped on just to play a few fucking games of MWR and I go against kids like this. It makes me want to fucking chop my dick off or some shit. Can't even finish what I'm talking about, man. These kids are playing like pussies. I'm sitting here watching the gameplay while I'm talking over it and I'm just like, God. I, I remember how pissed off I was. I only played like five games. And, um... But back to what I was saying, dude, it was it was too easy. All, like, all the kill streaks, like, they all counted towards your nuke. Like, a nuke was like a kill streak you, or you set up. So you could do, like, a Harrier, Chopper Gunner, and a nuke. And the Harrier, seven kills, you get seven kills in a row. That gets your Chopper Gunner, and your Chopper Gunner, you call that bitch in. It was overpowered as fuck, or your AC-130, whatever. And it got your nuke, so. But it was fun, man. Like, there was kill streaks were fun. They were fun to get. They, were, they weren't too hard to get. But there was a lot of broken stuff in the game. So I'm kind of split on like, because I know for a fact, get fucked bitch, I know for a fact that they were going to change the game, right? There was no doubt about that. So, I mean, if you're going to change a game, you might as well like balance, you know, some of the things. Like in this game, for example, they added all these new guns, camos, all this shit, which, um, you know, people were pissed off about, but you can't do anything. But they never like nerfed the M16. The M16 is like the strongest gun in this game by far. Like, it's just one burst everybody. You can get a collateral with one burst. It's nuts how strong it is. And this kid's just camping in the back. He fucks me in a minute. I try to get him, but he's a little bitch. Camping with Juggernaut. Um, but back to what I was saying about MW2, man. It was just fun. Like, Call of Duty lately has been lacking, like, the fun factor or whatever. But this definitely would have brought it back. I mean, I believe in the future sometime that... There's probably going to be an MW2 remastered, maybe even next year, when, I think, I think Infinity Ward's making the game next year. But, like, when MW4 or whatever the fuck comes out, um, after Black Ops 4, whatever game that is, I'm sure they'll, like, make an MW2 remaster or some shit. There's a better chance then. This was kind of random, being in, like, April and all, because this shit's never happened before. But I just don't understand why they were just releasing the campaign, unless they're, like, trying to tease us, like a whore or some shit. And just like showing a little bit at a time, getting us all hyped up, and then getting us all disappointed. But I don't know. 
because Fortnite is just like ruling everything right now. It's not even close. Like World War II flopped, Destiny 2 flopped. All those games are just fucking shit compared to Fortnite. You know, that's all I've been playing. But this actually was pretty fun. Even oh, this kid gets fucked. I'm just just look at this. This is a massacre. Oh yeah, I hear someone behind me. Come here, bitch. The deagle was nice in this game. I did enjoy the deagle. But like, I would have loved to had an MWT remaster. It would have been so much fun. Like, it would have just brought back all the nostalgia, and then like everybody who played or didn't get the chance to play the game in its prime would have gotten to play it again. You know, start from level one, rank up all the way. You got the quick scope of the intervention. You know, all that shit. It would have been awesome. But I guess we'll just have to, just have to wait and see and. I don't know, maybe it'll come out in the future, I'm sure it will, um, since they remastered COD 4, and it was really good, it's the only reason like Infinite Warfare got any sales, and Infinite Warfare honestly wasn't that bad of a game, but, I don't know man, like look, they even added like, uh, melee weapons, if you just saw I pulled out like a little hatchet looking ass thing, and they added melee weapons, could you imagine if they added melee weapons in MW2, like that was M16 right there, just destroyed me. But, like, you see, you can expect your gun and shit in this game, and you know that's gonna be an MW2. But could you imagine if they added melee weapons to MW2 with Commando Pro? God damn, that, you know how excited people would get? Like, people were excited in Black Ops 3 when they got, like, a fucking XMC or some shit. But a Commando uh, melee weapon? That shit's gotta be overpowered as shit. Like, um, if you guys didn't know MW2, Commando let you lunge farther when you knifed, and it was broken as shit. Like, someone would be, like, 15 feet away from you, and you'll melee, and you'll go kill them. But, yeah, that was just... Sorry for the little bitching kind of a video. It was just... I got this uh, news... I heard this news a few days ago, and it just... It's been fucking bothering me, because I love that game so much. But, you know, let me get, let me know what you guys think in the comments below about this. I think it's kind of bullshit. I'm sure it'll come out eventually. But, um, that was a quick little game on Crash. And uh, I ran out of time, so I'll probably end up putting something else, another gameplay on for a little bit. Maybe a Fortnite clip or some shit. But yeah, guys, let me know what you think about MW2, like the multiplayer not being remastered. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.